Alright, Life is Strange episode 2, let's do this! Life is Strange <clears throat> episode 2. Oh, we're in the principal's office. Okay. Cool stuff. Who's that? Uh, Rachel? Rachel's parents? Cool. Did we get in trouble? For ditching? Miss Price, how good of you to join us. I'm so sorry we're late. My, my shift ran late at the diner and then... Just... Sorry. My counselors see me bounce, and they give no shits at all. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with it. That's us. Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. is violated... Reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. Yes, it did. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. Right? Hey, you should listen. Yes. Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? No. Oh, what? Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? I don't. I don't remember. Uh, oh, don't screw up. I, I don't know. Uh, uh, don't get in trouble again? Trouble is merely the byproduct, Miss Price. What's at issue is your attitude. What? We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. I did not agree We that. did? Ex see, we did not. In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. Despite all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Disregarding posted signs about trespassing on the stage. Oh my shit, my bad. Implications of possible drug-related activities. What? what does that mean? Yes, what does that mean? It means Miss Price has developed a reputation as a user of marijuana. And I would strongly recommend you take a careful look through her room at home. Hey, she knows. Shall I continue? <laughs> Attempting to sabotage the academic goals of one of our top students. Yo, what? Victoria Chase. Oh, shit. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Woo. Ah. Uh... She cheated, man. Academic goals like doing her own homework? Because I thought Blackwell had a zero tolerance policy on plagiarism. Excellent suggestion. Stricter punishment for students who violate Blackwell's code of conduct is next on our agenda. Now hold on. Why is Chloe being punished for someone else's plagiarism? Exactly. The infraction involved both students. Victoria will be reprimanded as well. Yeah, right, bitch. Yeah, yeah, I bet. For her plagiarism, Miss Chase might have been suspended. Might have. If Mr. Prescott, Nathan Prescott, hadn't spoken to me on Victoria's behalf. Bitch ass and me. we have witnesses saying Miss Price was also involved in a bullying incident of the same Mr. Prescott. <sighs> what? Yo, we were defending him. Exactly. The hell I was. I stood up for that little weirdo. I suppose that's one interpretation of events. Say what you will about my daughter, but she is not a bully. Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. And Chloe's situation is less sensitive? I do not discuss other students' situations. We are here to discuss your daughter and her actions. Convenient. Let's reassure our mommy. We should be calm last. Oh, I'm sorry. Mom, you know this is all bullshit, right? I'm beginning to suspect that myself. I am sorry you feel that way, but your daughter's misbehavior is real and serious. It's not that serious. And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, 
We needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. What? What does that mean? Oh, it no. means... You forced my hand. Oh, no. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... I made her do it. <gasps> what? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. Oh. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. Rachel! See, okay. Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. She's such a real... <laughs> I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? Oh, for what? Wait, what? Forgive her for what? Well, co do you not see what she's doing? Well, yeah, but then she just like... Okay, whatever. Wait. <laughs> she's not gonna get into yeah, trouble. Sure. We're cool. Thank you. I'll make it up to you. I promise. Miss Amber. Based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Oh, uh, we'll tell Ray. you the full story later. <laughs> just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or... Coerce her? Yeah. I'm the just trying to get to the bottom of why someone like Rachel... Oh, I think we're clear, Principal Wells. <sighs> Someone like Rachel, but not my daughter. Mm. Excuse me? You have no right to treat Chloe this way. This is because she's on financial aid, isn't it? Oh. He calls us high risks. Oh. High risks? What kind of a label is that to put on a child? Oh. <laughs> I get it. This is about Blackwell's money troubles. Will you be dragging every other scholarship student into your office today as well? Tell me, will unfounded rumors about drug use also be mentioned, or is that only reserved for my daughter? Damn. Let's all just calm down. After everything we... She's been through in the last two years, you should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah. Miss Price. Mrs. Price. Uh, uh, Mrs. Price. I appreciate your position, but I assure you, it is only your daughter's past behavior that has led us here today. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance <gasps> of The Tempest. No way! No. No. No, 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 no Sandy, can we... <sighs> The performance is tonight, bitch. What the performance is tonight? For someone so aware of our school calendar, Miss Price, I would expect fewer absences on your record. Damn. Ray, she loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, Ray, Mr. Think, Amber, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances, oh. accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria. Victoria oh my fucking god. <laughs> How fitting. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. Nah. That is what such What was that, Miss Price? It's bullshit. I said that is Chloe such bullshit. She's upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next. Unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Well, no, take the, I will no, take, take, the the, blame. take the blame. Take no it. way is Rachel missing the play for me. But thanks to her acting skills, I'll have to go down in flames if I want to fix this. Oh shit. Okay, we we know, we know, we know. Get your yes. head out of your ass, Wells. Yeah, oh, Wells. <laughs> you <laughs> seriously think yesterday was a little Miss Sunshine's idea? Yep. Miss Amber has accepted her responsibility. 
You are unacceptable. You're punishing her for taking the blame for me? For trying to be a good person? That makes you even more clueless than I thought. Bitch. Rachel confessed. Are you calling her a liar? I confess she can act. I confess to thinking she can act like a motherfucker. You just bought her crap. Hook, line, and sinker. You don't have to do this. It's okay. Really. I will do it for you. Too late. You know. You do you. Yeah, yeah, don't be. How about you don't take credit for my shit? Oh. You don't see me claiming I did my homework, do you? Because that's your stupid thing. Uh, Chloe, this can't be you. Apologize this instant. Uh... Fine. Mr. Wells, Woo! I'm sorry for exposing the flaws in your campus security. This must be very embarrassing for you. I've heard enough. Rachel, you were clearly trying to cover for your classmate. I appreciate the motive, but I appreciate honesty more. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You will not be removed from the oh. Oh. Yay, girl, we got so you. Hard? Thank you. And Miss Price, I came into today's meeting planning to suspend you for the rest of the school year, with a chance for reinstatement in the fall. And now? You are expelled. Oh, <laughs> hell no! What? No. I will have Skip Matthews escort you to clean out your locker. You may wait outside my office until he arrives. Damn. That is all. Good day, Mrs. Price. Mr. and Mrs. Amber. Ray. R Ray. Come on, Chloe. Damn. Oh. I mean, she kind of deserved it. Not gonna lie. She skipped school once. I'm sorry. Nothing to be sorry about. Meet me at the junkyard later? You bet. Ooh! Oh. Okay. Oh. Mom, I'm... I'll see you in the parking lot. Oh, no. I'm sorry, Mom. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me. Hey, Skip. Fuck them. <clears throat> Bunch of fascists. <laughs> <laughs> I like Skip. Hey, uh... Just wanted to say, it sucks what is happening to you. Thanks, Skip. You're gonna be missed. Hey, uh, uh, you're gonna get <laughs> stuck. I don't really care about any of this shit. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Um, you have to find it. Chemistry, just take it, you like it. What? <laughs> <laughs> that was a Silly kid. Billy. All right, hold on. Just trash it. Does she have half a bagel in there? Doesn't she have to return them to the library or something? <sighs> Retrieve. Oh. Jackpot. Damn. Okay, Chloe. You better Wait. hide that. What the hell? What? Damn it, Justin. Chloe, hey, I had to borrow your stash. Desperate times, you know. I promise I'll get you back next week. We ain't gonna be here next week. Yeah, bitch. Justin. Justin <laughs> motherfucking ass. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck every inch of this place. I wish I could tag it from floor to ceiling. But with Skip watching me... <gasps> We're gonna have to get rid of it. Uh, bathroom. Then I'm out. Cool? <sighs> okay. But try to make it fast, will you? Yo, Chloe, this is where you got killed. Yep. Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh. Hey. What? What? Okay. Hey. Oh, 
Chloe. Victoria, you better just walk off. <laughs> Calm down. It's not that big of a deal. We're gonna get our ass beat in the car. Don't always know. Later, Skip. Later. Hey, can I skip this part? <laughs> get it? Yeah, get it. Uh, I don't really want to talk in his muscle Looks car. Like David's here. Hey, Rachel texted us. Oh, wait. Hold up, we got a lot of messages. Wanna look at all of them? Yeah, let's look at mom's first. Um, I'll be mom. Chloe, did you hear there's a fire? Please text me so I don't worry. Chloe, are you okay? Chloe, please. I'm fine. Oh, thank goodness. Come home by curfew. We have that meeting early tomorrow. Again, Chloe, really? Chloe, you can't keep doing this to me. I'm trying my best. Sure. Okay. What is that? Urgent, fire weather oh. update. Oh, shit. We started that. Alright, Rachel. Mom. No, wait, Elliot, Elliot. Oh, that's the same. There we go. Holy shit, did you get Wells' text about fire? Are you okay? Yeah, yeah you. you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'm just in my room. Hey, after Tempest, you wanna hang out? Oh, I forgot. Okay. And no response. Chloe's a bitch sometimes. Wow, you're texting a lot now. God I mean, damn! All DMs. <laughs> damn, hello DMs. I see you, Rachel. Oh, okay. Made it into my house without seeing either of my parents. Sweet. <laughs> sorry. Were you born to be a spy? You Jump were born to be a spy. Oh, you, I'm sorry. Jumping out of yeah. trains and shit. Oh man, we'd make such a great team. No enemy viewfinder would ever be safe from you again. Haha, <laughs> meanwhile you're deep undercover as a passed out person. LOL, today was unforgettable. Some of it sucked. Yeah. You know what doesn't suck? What? You. Oh! I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you also don't suck. I know. We should probably sleep. Got Wells tomorrow morning. Yeah, my fault. Worth it. Wells blows. That meeting hella sucked. You're hella weird. You are. Seriously, it's okay. Yesterday was worth it. Sure was. <laughs> okay, right. back now. Well, is he texts us. What the fuck? He has our number. We've been getting DMs. We, we, have, the, we have his contact picture. <laughs> Members of the Blackwell community. Uh, okay, wildfire. Uh, forest watch. Caution. All right. Yeah, we know. Okay. We know. There's a fire in That's California it. right now. There's 22 <laughs> fires. Oh my god! Are you serious? Oh hey, drug free zone. Hey, Elliot. What brings Chloe Price to school on a Saturday morning? Nothing good, I bet. I was expelled. Wait, really? Holy shit! Do you want a hug? Yes. 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 <laughs> uh, <laughs> chill. Okay. Hug me. Look at him. He was. Oh! oh. <laughs> Don't hug let Rachel back, see. Chloe. Hug him back. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, he's Thanks. a new Warren. <laughs> he is. Was Rachel Amber involved? Yeah. And let me guess. Did she get off scot-free? Hey, don't well, find revenge. Yeah. Oh. But she tried to cover for me. Uh-huh. Anyway, what are you doing here? Waiting for you. I thought I should come early to grab tickets. For the Tempest? Tempest. You said we might see it together. Ah, uh, right. Good call. Did you get my text about hanging out afterwards? Yes, I did. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Ah, uh, shit. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. I mean, I'm not really big on making plans, but maybe. Cool, cool. Uh, sounds sounds good. Cool, cool. cool. Bird. Can we graffiti the bird? Uh, okay. Yeah. Bye. Elitist Blackwell bird. Oh, oh. What if that was the bird that got into Chloe's house in the original game? It could be. Look at David's About parking. Damn time. Look at his David, parking. David, please. <sighs> David, please what? Work on your fucking parking, bro. Exactly. Bitch, speak. Boy? Chloe, your mother and I have been talking. <laughs> I don't care. 
I don't care. I know. That's what we need to talk about. I don't need a conversation. Not with Sergeant Asshat here. I just need some space. Do not use that language with your mother. She's my mother. If my mother has something to say, she will say it to me. She has. The problem is, you don't listen. Okay, true. Maybe if you try listening to me, instead of fighting me about everything, you might actually learn a thing or two. Or not. What? Like how to have no job? Or how to be a soldier? Chloe. <laughs> Soldiers put family and future above self and now. Getting kicked out of school? That's what losers do. Did you just call us a loser? Hey. You had a scholarship, Chloe. Do you know what that means? What kind of opportunity you gave up? Do you want to work at the diner? I mean, nothing wrong with that. It's true, I mean, if she does it. There's nothing wrong with waiting tables, Mom. Chloe, I'm proud to wait tables because it means you can be whatever you want to be. But what is that, Chloe? What do you want? Chloe, I care about Joyce very much. I'm willing to forgive you for the incident yesterday. Oh. If you improve your attitude going forward. I'll do it. Incident? Nothing. What yo, incident? yo, nothing, nothing. No. Hey, just Chloe was incredibly okay. out of uh. line. She insulted me, swore at me. What a snitch. But with an apology, I'm willing to start over. Oh my God, are we gonna have to apologize? Sure. Sure, okay. Let's start changing her. Sure. Reset button pressed. Chloe, I'd like you to empty your pockets and place all your belongings on the trunk of the car. Okay. Do we what have that fuck? joint? Do we have that If we are thing? going to start over, we have to know that you are not abusing drugs. If you're not, you should be eager for the chance to prove it. Let's go, Chloe. Quit stalling. Oh, what's gonna happen? Should we just Come just on. just do it? Yeah. yeah. Fine. You want to see my shit so badly? <laughs> do we? <laughs> do we have the joint still? Maybe. Oh no, not our marker. <gasps> oh. <laughs> You're forgetting something. Ooh, weed. Oh no. The horror. <laughs> Happy. Don't take our marker, please. It's marijuana, all right. Marijuana. <laughs> no, Chloe, I am not happy. But I am relieved that you came clean. I hope this can be the beginning of a new chapter for oh, us. Oh, Joy's gonna smoke it up tonight, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> we both agree that the best thing for everyone at this stage is for me to move in. Oh, oh that's God. Right. Okay. No fucking way. Chloe, after everything that's happened, I'm at a loss. I need help. Exactly. Right. We need a firmer hand steering this ship. Talk to me, Chloe. Tell me what you're feeling. You're trying. I get it. I, I swear, I do. And I've been making it harder for you. But this is not the answer. It's the only answer I have, Chloe. In a million years, I never thought you'd choose David over me. What? Hey, come on, Chloe. I'm sorry I took that for granted. I'm not choosing anyone over anyone else. It's about the three of us having a home together. It'll be better than you think, Chloe. Once everything's running smoothly, you'll see what a stable home can be like. Run away, girl. <laughs> run away. Take Just the run bike. Away. Take the bike. <laughs> Let's go with Elliot instead. <laughs> Do we still have our, our marker though? Hey! Come 
home. There is no home. Not if he's there. Yeah, run away, Chloe. Chloe. Let her go. She'll come home as soon as her tantrum is over. Um, we're never coming home. And it's never going to be over. <laughs> Tantrums are for children. Why is she smoking? I thought she got rid of everything. She has cigarettes. How do you know which way is up when your whole life has been turned upside down? Deep. Blackwell's done with me. I can't go home anymore. Just got the junkyard. Is this junkyard all I've got left? Maybe. Yeah. Start smashing things again. Hey, that's your truck. <gasps> it is? She likes it. Isn't it isn't her truck supposed to be blue though? Up. Yo, you don't know how to do this, do you? Ugh. She might. Oh, yes, yeah, she does. Remember when she was helping? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Davis car. Oh, that battery is fucked. This thing is a mess. But maybe I can fix it. Oh, you have to go find another battery. If this oh, beast will ever run again, the first thing it. What? I'm so sorry. What's the first thing? Chloe, David's trying to do what he thinks is best. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh my god. Chloe, David's trying to do what he thinks is best. He's such a tool. I didn't like that he asked you to empty your pockets, but then you had weed, didn't you? Because it's awesome. I just don't know what to do anymore. It rhymes with what? Cleave Flavid. What the fuck is Leaf. that? David. <laughs> oh. Chloe, can't you just forget about David for a second? Think about me. Maybe I just need space, okay? Maybe I need my daughter back. Well, I wanted my mother back, but she wasn't even there. Needs is a new battery. See? Go to- I wonder if I can find one around here. All right. That can't be the only thing wrong with the car, Chloe. Well, Chloe, you, you need, need to battery. think again, okay? You need to think again. That car looks not- it looks okay. Hey, what happened here? Mr. Here's Jefferson? The side of Arcadia <laughs> Bay, they don't put on the postcards. Yo, y'all know who was here? Who? Mr. Jefferson. Sure. Mark motherfucking Jefferson. It has to be this car. It looks the cleanest. What are you trying to hide under there, hood? It's gonna have to be this car. We're gonna it's right there. Pop it open right there. Come on, Chloe. Wow. Hey, what? Take, Take this. Wow. You have to check it first. Here we go. The pick of the litter. Ooh. It looks like it's good. Just put it in your pocket. <laughs> All right, bitch. Wait, did she really? Yeah, she did. She lost. Open. Open. It's like a rat. <gasps> oh my god, that's the bobblehead that she finds. That, really? that, no, it's the bobblehead that's in her car in the first season. Insert picture here. Wait, this is radio. Is that a radio? Turn on. A. Play the slaps. And up next, a local band called Pisshead is blowing. <gasps> no way. Here's their new single, Nothing Wrong. Oh shit, bro, this is some hey, I'm proud lit of fucking action right here. Oh my god, the controls. Oh my god, wait, 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 Go, look. Turn the camera over there. Up, 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 up. It's the fire. It's oh, still going on. Ooh, look at that. Why well, should not even work? <laughs> Girl, don't get electrocuted, please. Oh my! <laughs> like I just said. <gasps> oh. That works. Is you good? Now it 
needs gas, new tires, everything. A screwdriver. <laughs> oh wow. Chloe Price. That's what you need. With it. Damn. This thing needs more love than I can give right now. In the meantime, maybe I can spruce it up a bit. Oh. Oh. Chloe Price. Yes. I. Oh, I don't suck. You really, really don't. My mom thinks I do. Rose. Don't know if I can stand going home tonight. Still there? Grabbing something from home, then I'll meet you at the junkyard. See you really soon. You better. Hey, you better. Damn, this car is far. You can hang here, but I get to pick the tunes. Okay? Good talk. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Ooh. While an escape hatch could be nice. I should probably cover over this massive hole. Oh, is there something the we could have at? taken? Maybe. Okay. It's like finding those freaking bottles again. <laughs> okay. Let's see what else this trash heap has to All offer. Right. Can we see. grab the mannequin head? No. Um, use it as a light bulb. Here, beach towel. Yeah. What Perhaps? else? The welcome mat was on the other this side. This could cover that torn seat. And look awesome doing it. <laughs> True. She just shoved that right in her pocket. Mm -hmm. Light bulb. Uh, Light bulb, there it is. You might not work. Then again, I hardly ever work. Oh, okay. Is that a red light? <laughs> I mean, that'd be kind of sick. Then set the mood. Today, you begin an exciting new life as a floor mat. How does she just fit everything in I her know, pocket she like has some that? Big ass pants. She kind of thick. <laughs> she hella thick. What? Oh. Um. Fix this. Fix. <laughs> Interior design. Love it. Hey, that okay. looks good. It looks okay, yeah. Fix this. Grab that beach towel right out of your pocket. Hey, that hey, actually looks pretty good. That looks good as hell. Hey, that's a big ass beach blanket. <laughs> or beach towel. Alright, let's uh, get this light yeah. here. It just probably doesn't even work. Cool though. Mm -hmm. This thing looks like a rusted out shopping cart. Probably drives like one too. That's if it ever does drive, which seems questionable. Still, how sweet would that be? Very. Poor Shadow. Who's calling? Mom? Or is it Rachel? Yeah. Frank, it's Frank. Oh, oh, hell no. Hey, Frank. What's up? Yeah, just checking in to see how you're doing. Really? No. Listen, we've got some business to discuss. Oh. Where can we meet? What about... Oh, like... drugs? Christ. I'm hanging out in the junkyard, north of town. The junkyard, that's great. Stay there, I'll see you soon. What's gonna happen? Okay. Uh. And Frank, is everything cool? I'm not in trouble or anything, right? I don't know. Did you do anything you should be in trouble for? <laughs> like in general, I like or how they pan to, to you? The fire. I'll see you soon. Well, we're in trouble. 
And we're walking round the edges You were flaunting all your open wounds I can't express them better than you You have buried childish qualities from me Hey, we're falling asleep. William dream again? Oh no. Oh, where the hell are we? Michelle, where are we? It's another dream. Oh, I shit. I slept all day. I don't know. Nope. What's next to us? It's that purple kush. <laughs> oh. oh, fuck. Is that our dad? Is that our papa? Yeah, what keeps following us? It's a crow, symbol of death. Oh, something. Oh, I don't like these dreams. You don't? They're kind of scary. Aww. Uh, I think they're cool. Yeah, that's our dad. Dad? Papa? Marshmallows? Oh. Stick. And put a marshmallow on it. Marshmallow. Stab. <laughs> Do I even like marshmallows? <laughs> you will right now. Rose dude. Sorry. That's trippy. Amazing, isn't it? I can't look away. Sure. Don't pretend you're not mesmerized too. Mm. See? You're so drawn to it, you don't even realize the danger. Danger? Fire blinds us. What? Just like darkness. But darkness blinds with absence. With loss. What does fire blind with? Beauty. Eclipse? Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> but sometimes there's a Greater beauty yet to come. Oh, this is so trippy. Incredible. Fire is jealous, Chloe. It wants all the beauty for itself. That's why you need to be careful. Oh, okay. <laughs> the bird starts talking. What? Game of Thronesy stuff right there. Oh, he got roast dude. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> 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 oh, <laughs> she didn't even smoke it. Hasn't anyone ever told you not to fall asleep with a lit cigarette? You could start a fire. Shut up, you started Bruh, a fire. Bruh, what did you just do last episode, huh? <laughs> Why do you put it out in your car? Yeah, Chloe. I mean, not your car yet, but... So, are you gonna invite me in? Or what? Of course. Of course. <laughs> I love giving rides to strange drifters. Hop in. Go around. <laughs> Thanks. No, he's, she's gonna climb on top of us? <laughs> I thought that was a person. Oh my god! Thought that was a person. She really took all her stuff with her. Okay. Damn. You've been busy. It's nothing. Just some junk I found lying around. 
Look good though. A rainbow towel? Hey, it looks good. A freaky red light? Mm -hmm. To be freaky. Look at that little dude. Chloe, this is incredible. I, I can't believe you found us an escape vehicle already. <laughs> Uh, that's the hope. But it doesn't exactly drive yet. You'll figure it out. And while you're at it, we're also going to need some money. Well, <laughs> you know, to buy stuff. We should have kept the uh -huh. money. Car and oh, money. True. <laughs> Anything else you'd like? Luckily, there's no rush. True. And no Blackwell. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Holy shit. <laughs> that Wells meeting. I'm so sorry. At least Wells has no idea what really went down with us last night. Yeah. Shit got pretty wild. Fire. <laughs> I was gonna do that. <laughs> pretty wild? Really? Rachel, that was more than pretty wild. You went absolutely nuts last night. What the hell were you thinking? I was angry. I didn't expect the whole stupid park to go whoosh. But now you're in on it too. Accessory after the fact. Unless you tell on me, of course. I'm no snitch. <laughs> I'd be way happier going to jail than having to live at home with Dick Tater David. What are all these he names? His plans I know. To move in this morning. Does she like write them down somewhere? Like, she's like a little oh, like notebook. Chloe, that's awful. I'm so sorry. You know what we both could use? <laughs> Therapy. Good luck paying Therapy. for it. You know what you she start. means. Kick back and tell me what's oh. bothering you. I thought she meant like no. <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, Doc. <laughs> David. There's this dildo with a mustache who's been dating my mom and now he thinks <sighs> he's moving in with us. How do I stop him? Hmm. Kill him. That's a hard one. What? I'm not sure there's really anything you can do. Then what the hell am I talking to you for? <laughs> Just because you can't stop him doesn't mean you don't fight back. The resistance begins now. Alright. You're going to need a new nickname to mark your enemy. What have you got? Stop douche. He's a step douche because he's inserting himself where he doesn't belong. Also, Ooh. he's a douche. <laughs> Poetic. May I also suggest stepladder? Why stepladder? Because he climbs on your mom every night. Oh, and Rachel. pretty soon they'll be stepping down the aisle. What oh. the hell kind of therapist are you? <laughs> Sorry. It's called shock therapy. <laughs> Highly controversial. <laughs> and now it's your turn. Tell me all about what it's like being daughter of Arcadia Bay's most famous scumbag. It sucks. Oh, no. Too blunt? Sorry. I do that sometimes. Nah, I'm just... Ugh, I don't know. Shit. It's time for the play. I feel As if my life didn't have enough drama in it. Good luck. Uh, why don't you You go? know you're never supposed to tell an actor good luck before a show? It's bad luck. That makes sense. How is telling someone good luck bad luck? Exactly. You're supposed to say, break a leg. That's dumb. <laughs> break a leg. Hey, I, I was thinking that after the show, maybe we could go do something. Just you and me. Something criminal? Criminally fun. Hey. <laughs> I'm in. Don't we have to go anyways? Wait, you forgot your bag. It's for you. Oh, what? Just a little survival kit for your new life on the lam. <sighs> drive safe, Chloe. I mean, we ain't going nowhere with this car, but what's in it? We'll drive safe. It's a bunch of weed. It's a body. <laughs> it's David. <gasps> oh, it's their spot. Yeah. Uh. 
Hello, Junk Shack. The radio is still playing. Gotta fix this baby up. <laughs> A bag full of clothes. Oh, are we gonna change? Yes, I need those. Yo, I got premium. Try on. I got the deluxe thing. <laughs> Nothing like an abandoned shack in the middle of a junkyard to make a girl feel like exploring a new wardrobe. Oh. That one was cool. I saw that one. The last one. I like this one. Let's look at the other ones first. Yeah, she's looking good though. Uh, Frank? Is he here? I'm at the junkyard now. Knew it. Okay, let's look for him. Where he at? Should we look around oh. first? Let's look around first. <gasps> Graffiti! Graffiti! That's it. I mean, yes. Hey, looking sick though. Hey, look at that big ass one, Rexy. Hey, oh my god, can we graffiti on it now? Um. That's the woman we saw with Rachel's dad. <gasps> what is this connection? She, is she has a butterfly. Look at that. Yo! Frank, it's Chloe. She's dead. <laughs> you don't know the secret A password, too early. man. Is the password drugs? <laughs> Price, get your ass in here. <laughs> Dude, it smells like piss in here. Shut up. You have a rough night or something? Every night's a rough night. I've got a notebook in the back somewhere. Go get it for me, would you? The notebook? Who is that one? Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> Where are they yeah. going? Jeez, man. Get Where my notebook, Price. Then we'll talk. He's kidnapping us. We're being kidnapped. Now I'm fetching Hold up. Dude, I heard you got expelled. Bad news. Where's my shit, man? Oh, you mean good news? I'm stoked. Word, I'm home too. I finally got busted yesterday for smelling like <laughs> My mom's making me go to her book group. Aw, oh, man. Oh man. Where's Thanks my stash? How low can I go? And we're back. Ooh, hat, can we take- So Frank's a fellow survivor of Black Hell. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. Is a puppy in here? <gasps> hey there. Oh, it's a little puppy. Oh, it's a little puppy. Oh, shit. Pompadour, get up here. Oh, so cute. Pompadour. You little oh. killer. Oh, oh, my. Oh, my God. Hold up. Can we take the puppy? <laughs> Tempest is going to be awesome. Like, awesomely bad, I mean. Oh. It's gonna be hilarious. Hey, don't worry about being expelled, okay? Dude, I'm fine. Thank you. Devin? Can we take the puppy? Oh, go pet the puppy. Oh, it's just laying down. Oh, oh man. I hope Argus and Bowser are okay. Take it? Oh, I saw a knife in the way. Where? Is this one I think it is? Glad I paid that off. <laughs> Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. Yo, take take Frank's time. <laughs> Swingy, flippy instrument of death. Is it? Aww. Oh, Just go through it. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadour, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. It's French. <laughs> oh, 
Sure for sure what. Does it mean, like, tough guy or something? Do I look like I speak fucking French? Well, then why would you do... What the fuck? Damn. It's your problem. Okay. Yeah, Frank. So, who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV. Oh, yeah. I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. <laughs> Oh, shit. Okay, Frank. No, d we're demanding, demanding an answer. Rachel would want to know more. I bet I can convince Frank it's harmless to tell me. Dude, I'm just curious. What's the big deal? Idiot. I make money by being discreet. Uh, I don't know. It's not like you oh, signed no. a confidentiality a agreement. You can be less discreet this one time. Oh, no. Nope. I protect my clients. Happy customers are the foundation of a good business. Hey, so uh, I had this dream the other night about a cloud that swallowed Arcadia Bay. You too? See? We're a lot alike, Frank. We've got shit in common. Sure, I guess. So why are you so hung up on this chick? Come on, Frank. This is Arcadia Bay. Gossip is all we have to keep us from hanging ourselves out of boredom. <laughs> I mean, true. Well, I guess you're not asking for life or death information here. True. You know when I joke about being your favorite customer? I'm kind of yes. not joking. Deep down in your gut, I think you know you can totally trust me. I don't know. Frank. Talk. And I'll get my mom to make you something special. Like what? Uh... How about that firehouse chili of hers? <laughs> <laughs> Why does he love beans so much? You got it. The woman you saw. Her name's Sarah. Showed up a few weeks ago. Causing all kinds of trouble for all sorts of people. <laughs> like who? It's a little out of your league, okay? Um, but what kind of trouble, exactly? Forget about it, Chloe. You shouldn't have opened my mouth. Come on. You hear the mill burn down? Yep. Yeah. I, uh, heard some stuff about it. Crazy. My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. <sighs> money from what? Well, he's always had a few things going on. I help him out with some of them. Don't drown me in the details, Frank. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like. But I don't seem Aww. to have much leverage with him like I once had. Anyway, you and I have shit to discuss. I've got a little job for you. What? Open my notebook. Last page. Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. Oh. You know him? Yeah. <laughs> Drew North? Yeah, he's... Oh, holy shit. That's a lot of money. Drew runs oh, Oxy for Damon. Apparently, football players eat it like candy. Oxycodone. That's smart, I guess. It pays well. Go Bigfoots. Uh. Problem is, Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering my calls. A grant. You know what's going on with him? He's a douchebag. Uh, he's an unreliable douchebag. No, this is the first time he's done this. The kid's actually smart. But he's a dick. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, oh. find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Uh, it's this gonna, is gonna be handle. hard because we're expelled. What's in it for me? Yeah, of course. But what's in it for me? I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Uh uh. Okay. It's a hundred dollars. Yeah. Sure. Because we need the money, right? I'll do it. Sure. What's the matter? Uh, I'm expelled. It might be a little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackwell. I got expelled this morning. Congratulations. It's still easier for you to go on campus than for me. True. I guess. If you can't even do this price, a hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay. With a bit of cash and the truck fixed. For 
Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. I'll do it. Good deal. Okay, Chloe. 